Elder Nobed Ezani has said the living should be very careful in celebrating life and that some people are not living life in a way that they will be celebrated when they pass on. He added that every human should avoid all things that are not in the right direction, urging all to have feelings for other people. Ezani made the statement at the late Mrs. Bridget Agbo Ogbe's burial ceremony in Agbo Delta State. He called on Nigerians to be closer to the Creator who knows heaven and earth and realizing that life is by God's grace and not man's making, just as Mama lived for everybody around her. For the living is that we should be very, very, very careful. Yeah, because we've come to celebrate life, well lived life. Some of us are not living in a way that our lives should be celebrated like this when we are no more. We should be very careful with life. We should not do all the things that we can do. We cannot say all the things that we can say. We should, we should think twice. We should consider our fellow human beings. We should be considerate. And we should be closer to our Creator. I'm today. today. He's a good mother. He brought up uh, the, the, the children in a better way. And I'm happy with the way the children have commented about, about her. God will keep her. A, a, a better place, whatever she is to. Folks are looking at getting to that age. Anybody who crossed 70 years should thanks, should be giving thanks to God because it is not easy. Our wish is to go above 80. Nobody wants to die, but we pray to live more than 80 years. But if you're opportune to get up to 80 years, you should be grateful to God. So we are really happy that she get to 80 years. Those are about Mama. She lived a very good life. She was able to bring up her children on the path of truth, on the path of Christianity, which is a good way to go. And uh, with the crib of people we are seeing here, it's obvious that she lived a good life. Our prayer is that now that Mama has left us, she will rest in the bosom of the Lord. And for those that she left here, God will continue to protect them and guide them. The age of 80, she didn't give us problem. That's why we thank God. She didn't give us any difficulty, and she made us to know that she wants to go and rest. That is the most important thing, that she wants to go and rest. And we on our own were surprised that in this modern generation, that an elderly woman will call her family and inform us that she wants to go and rest. She prayed for us and blessed our children individually, so we were surprised. So if that thing can happen now, which means uh, it, it, it pays for people to be, to, to be holy and sincere, to live a good life. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.